a thousands of years in refining, super efficient, most efficient way of doing this, I would say. Just like a bicycle is the most efficient way to put, put down miles. Everything, everything above and beyond this is, you get, is a diminishing return in energy expenditure and productivity output. It's like meditation in motion for me. It's just really soothing and it puts you in connection with the energy of the earth. It's nice and quiet. I could do it when my kids were napping. I could do it uh, in the evening. I could do it early in the morning and I didn't feel like I was being a nuisance. I go through with one pass and then I go back through two or three times and you just keep working it closer to the edge. So you end up with something that at times, depending on the grass you're cutting, you, are, you tailor the blade to what you're cutting. So if I was going to be cutting really thin, delicate clover, you could make this thing, you can run your fingernail underneath it and it will create a ripple, like, like a wave, because you make it so thin. But for the, the goldenrod and reed canary and that tougher kind of stuff like that, um, that would be probably too delicate. You'd end up then fracturing it. It feels so non-destructive and gentle and... Um, life-sustaining in a sense. You know, when, when we had the lawnmower, you just run things over. And with the hand mowing, you feel like you're a part of it and you can see the crickets and the grasshoppers jumping out of the grass, the praying mantis, you know, all of it. It's, it's like you're in their environment and you're not destroying them. And when you're mowing, you really are just focused on the sound, the grass, everything else disappears.